my name is Nick Winky. I work for McFarland Pheasants. I'm going to show you how to sex male and female pheasants. So right here I got a male. Easy for me. I've been doing it for a little while. You look at the lines above and below the eye. See if I can find you a female here. Here's a female in my right hand, male in my left. If you look at the heads, it's got a slope to her. She's not blocky style. Or you look at a male, a male's got the blockier style head. He's more squared. You look at the eyes on them. The hen doesn't have much for a waddle. It's got a little bit down below, but it has nothing up top. Or you look at a male, a male's got it all down below. It's got a very definite line between the eye and the nose and same up on top of the head. So we're gonna see if we can have somebody come over here and sex a bird after I show them. Come on up here, bud. Oh no, oh no. So you're looking, you're looking below the eye and above the eye. Yes, that is a male. Yep, male. We do a lot of sexing. I mean, we sex to our farm. We sex to a lot of other customers. So we we try to guarantee 90%. See how it how it breaks out between the eye and the nose right there. Okay. That would almost almost guarantee to give you the male trait. There's not a lot of feathering right in there, and then the water. You can see the water all the way oh, around. Oh sure. I had not seen that, but I couldn't tell because that was the first one that didn't either have or yep. not have the line. Yep, a lot of them are like that. And if they get extremely hard and you got a second guess, like that's an easy male. Yeah. But if you got a second guess, second guess it as a female. My name's Nick Winky. I work for McFarland Pheasants, and I really hope this helps your pheasant industry and sexing your birds. Thank you very much, and have a great day.